So this is just a video about your YouTube videos and how to actually sort those out on your website and to get them onto there. Um, so it's a, quite a straightforward process. You might need to watch this video a couple of times, but hopefully it'll make sense. So the first thing is load up Bramble, head over to your videos page, and you'll see these are all the ones that I have done for you already. Um, and so they're, they're already there. And it's done by actually just having a link to these videos. So what we'll do is we'll add a, a random video from the YouTube account that I've got, but obviously you just log into your YouTube video and add the links from yours, um, which will make more sense in a minute. So the first thing to do is over on the left hand side, you have duplicate, so click that. That's just done a copy of um, what we had here. It's just done a copy above. Then you'll go to YouTube. So this is my channel, but for you, obviously you'll go to your YouTube channel where your videos are. You click on the video that you want to upload. Um, so for example, if it's this one, we can pause that. You right click the video, then you copy the video URL. Back to Bramble. You go up to this latest top video. You click this little icon, which is the widget icon. And then you paste in that address that we've just copied straight in. Don't change any of these settings because these are preset to be the correct size. Um, and that's how you do it, that's literally it. So we've just linked it from YouTube by using that simple link. Again, you might need to watch that back if that doesn't make sense. Now for any videos that you don't want, you use the delete, the remove trash can icon on the left hand side. So for example, if you decided that you didn't want this video anymore, you remove it on the left hand side. A lot of people remove it up here, but that actually keeps the frame and doesn't remove it properly. So if you're trying to remove a video section, use the left hand side one here. Um, so hopefully that makes sense. Um, I will just quickly have a look at the menu side of things for you as well. I'll leave that page without saving it just so I don't do any damage. Obviously at the moment I've taken the videos page off for you um, because you didn't want that on there at the moment. Um, so this is just how you put this back on. Um, so you'd log in, go to menus, you're adding a link. So you see it adds a link here. You call that page videos. This bit's important. So you have to link the videos page, which is actually called videos. When you do it the first time, it doesn't always work. So a good tip is to just go to a random page and then go back to the videos page. And as long as it says videos here, that link will then work. So if it doesn't work first time round, go back, choose another random page within here, and then go back to your videos page and that tends to then clear it and make sure that it does work. To move the order down here, at the moment videos is tagged right on the end, you just drag it up where you want it in the menu. Um, simple as that. And then again, you publish those changes if you're happy with that. One thing I will say is your menu is now at its maximum width. Um, so you wouldn't want to add any more words or change too much in your menu, because on an iPad, on the smaller screens, it would end up not actually fitting. So adding the videos to the menu is fine, but don't change the wording or add any more buttons to the menu. We'd have to look at that if you wanted to do that to make sure that it resizes correctly for um, iPads in particular. So I hope that helps. And if you need any further um, assistance with this, just give me a shout. Thanks for watching.